If you're in the Pacific Northwest or around the Pacific Northwest and are passionate about shooting sports, TriggerCon is where you want to be. Gavin Gear here from UltimateReloader.com with more content from TriggerCon 2017. Now, if you're into long range shooting like I am, undoubtedly you're familiar with the reality TV show Long Range Reality. At TriggerCon, I got to meet one of the personalities from the show, Clint Sharp. Clint is also affiliated with In Motion Targets, maker of steel targets, and Rifle Sticks. Let's hear what he had to say about these products. So I'm here with Clint from Rifle Sticks and In Motion Targets. Thanks, man, for taking the time. Absolutely appreciate the opportunity to talk to you guys. Yeah, so here, here's what I've come to realize. If you start shooting on steel, you're gonna get hooked. I'm, I'm putting up steel all over the place on sure. my property now. Yeah, and that's what in motion is about, right? Sure, and I would say if you get hooked on paper and then you shoot steel, you never go back to paper. And, <laughs> yeah. You know, I start out uh, my shooting career on uh, F-class prone mm -hmm. paper uh, and then transition over to the tactical field style matches, which mm -hmm. is where uh, in motion targets was born from. Mm -hmm. um, all steel targets, uh, we have movers, turners, um, and you name it, we can make just about any size target or any shape of target you want from mm -hmm. uh, four inch coyotes all the way up to 72 inch coyotes if that's what your heart desires. Nice, and you guys use uh, in motion steel on long range reality, right? That's correct, yeah. yeah. Uh, long, range, uh, long range reality is sponsored by in motion targets, mm -hmm. one of the primary sponsors, and all of the steel and all the matches we use predominantly is in motion target yep. steel. Nice, and you yeah. got radius corners, you got no stress concentrations, you got no welds. No to welds, break. nope. Yep. Uh, and one of the unique features about our targets is is the, the, the hanger bracket is a rubber on a piece of basically a um, formed rebar, if you will. So the targets never actually have 100% touching anything to hold it up. Mm -hmm. It's a free target. So where you get that bong or that gong sound or that ah. deep, deep throaty sound, mm -hmm. doesn't matter if it's a six millimeter or a 338, you'll get that deep sound uh, just because the targets aren't touching anything. They allow that movement of the steel versus a rigid style mount where you're not gonna get that noise. Uh, and where it really comes into play is shooting these smaller caliber bullets at these field and tactical matches. You're shooting out 12, 13, 1400 yards and at six millimeter bullet doesn't yeah. pack a lot of energy at that distance. True. Um, so that's where our targets really come into play is hearing that, that bong or that gong uh, mm -hmm. and getting that reverberation, that sound, that feedback or that report off that target. Yeah, there's nothing like seeing the target move in the scope and then hearing and it then ring hearing, yeah, seconds that, later. Yep. It just never gets old. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. So in motion, tell me about uh, rifle sticks. So rifle sticks, uh, after field tactical shooting, carrying a tripod, the hog saddle, all that stuff, you know, that's just the extra weight. So what I wanted was a system that was quick to disconnect from the bipod. So essentially what it is, is it's plug and play. Harris or Atlas, doesn't matter. It pins onto the, the, the bipod, and then there's quick disconnects that you can put for your factory feet, hmm. or you can run spike feet specifically engineered for the quick disconnects. Everything's 100% interchangeable. So if you, for example, don't like Harris feet, but you got an Atlas bipod, mm -hmm. if you run the Atlas quick disconnects, throw on the OEM adapters, and now you can run Atlas feet in a Harris bipod hmm. with the Rifle Sticks quick disconnect system. So uh, Rifle Sticks is kind of a modular support system. Absolutely, and yeah. we run everything from 12 in, um, six inch to 12 inch extensions. Hmm. Uh, and it's gone to the point where now I run the, uh, the tallest Harris bipod you can get, 12 inch extensions, I can literally shoot standing up hmm. with a bipod in my 12 inch extension. So there's literally, very few shooting environments or situations in which I can't run hmm. a tall bipod and to be point blank, I haven't ran a hog saddle in four matches. Wow. PRS style field tactical mm -hmm. matches where you've needed that supported front. I just run with the rifle sticks, add it onto my tall Harris bipod. Nice. Uh, and it's, uh, it's effective, it's efficient, and you're not packing a much extra weight. Cool. So if people want to know more about rifle sticks, more about in motion, where do they yeah, go? Yeah, so if you're interested in uh, in some great quality steel, InMotionTargets.com, and then rifle sticks is simply RifleSticks.com, and uh, everything's in stock and available in either targets or rifle sticks. Awesome. So, Thanks, Clint. Thank you very much. Yep. Have Appreciate a good show. it. So if you want to know more about rifle sticks and in motion targets, please click on the first link in the video description. I've got links to more resources and a lot more information. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you don't want to miss any of the action on ultimatereloader.com, please subscribe to my channel. Till next time, happy shooting and happy reloading.